Low Drive Intelligence Community. That sound coming out of that wine bottle is exactly what I was hearing in my truck. And though I was not drinking while driving, that sound was being amplified by my Volant air intake, and I could not figure out what it was. I finally located the source. I'm going to show you what it was. driving intelligence, but I've got a harmonic coming out of my volant. I can feel it vibrating and I use my stethoscope. It definitely comes from inside here. I've taken it apart before to try to figure it out. Maybe you hear it? i got to take it apart again because it's driving me crazy. Just drones in the cab. You know me, I love to get the noise out of the truck, out of any vehicle. So I completely removed the volant and there is nothing going on inside here. I cleaned out the filter. The filter's all tight, all the medium is tight. There's no loose parts in here that would cause vibration. I checked everything within the uh, mass airflow meter. So I couldn't find any obvious issues. What I did was I left this whole assembly off. I reconnected the mass airflow meter, started the vehicle with this open pipe going into the engine, and I could barely hear the same tone except lower. So I think that the Volant is like a megaphone for any noise coming back up through the air intake. The only thing that was making a little too much noise to me was the inlet air control valve. And uh, I think I might take it out and clean it, but it might be time just to replace it since it's got 222,000 miles on it. And um, uh, that, that should be the issue, or I'm hoping that's the issue. I use my stethoscope everywhere else on the engine, the EGR, all, the pulleys, the valve covers, everything was perfectly quiet, sounds the way it should. Uh, the only thing that sounds a little off is that inlet air control valve. So I'm gonna go get another one and see what that does for me. Quick note before we go forward, um, I don't like to just replace parts because I think they might be bad. I like to test them. One thing I didn't talk about at the vehicle was that um, I took the stethoscope and ran it against all those components, as I mentioned. Uh, I was getting what sounded like a little bit of grinding that was coming out of the IAC. And since the, uh, the, the harmonic coming out of that volant was not consistent, sometimes it would happen, sometimes it wouldn't, I used the throttle to throttle up the engine. The resonance went away, and there was definitely a different sound in the IAC. It didn't sound as grindy or noisy. So definitely the noise was coming back from the IAC, probably old, worn out, dirty, coming up to, that, to the volant and being like a megaphone, just making the noise extremely loud. And now for the bourbon bolt of the day. That one bolt that the automotive engineers wanted to make sure was as difficult as possible to drive you to the bar after you finished your maintenance activity. The idle air control valve is really tucked behind the engine against the firewall, so it, uh, it's a little difficult to get at that angle. You can see that those two 5 16 bolts are pointed toward the, uh, the firewall at a difficult angle, and the electrical connector is all the way at the end of that, so even further toward the, uh, the firewall. Remove the original inlet air control valve, and I've got the new one in hand. Typically the problem with these is they get dirty, and it causes the, the valve not to operate properly. I'll, and I'll show you what the difference between a clean one and a new one. The new idle air control valve is on the right, and you can see how clean that is. Uh, this one is the original 222,000 miles. It's pretty crusty inside. A lot of times you can just clean them out. I've done that before, and uh, I'm just not getting the performance that I want out of it. So that's why I decided to go ahead and get a new one, put it in there. Um, and I'm hoping this will resolve the resonance I'm getting, which is being amplified by that Volant air intake system. And it looks like there's some differences in design. Anyway, I'm going to install a new one now. So the truth is in the pudding, and I uh, started the vehicle up, and it is absolutely quiet, quieter than before. No resonance being amplified through the air intake system. Definitely controlling the idle. So this was successful. That idle air control valve was vibrating and causing some kind of resonance and uh, the replacement absolutely took care of the problem. Thanks for watching. Please give me that thumbs up. Please subscribe and I'll see you next time on Driving Intelligence.